friends i hope that you are doing well as i'm filming this it is saturday the 6th of april and um, you can already see that we have a fun unboxing in store for us today um, it is from mtt diamonds and there's the contact details and the website and if you have purchased um, diamond paintings from manette the owner of mtt diamonds then you would recognize this big tube um, so I had a custom made uh, by Manette and um, I received it in this huge tube it is um, probably a meter long <laughs> um, I will show you when I zoom out and show you this beauty so um, I just um, opened this up as you know it comes with these end caps um, the tube was also sealed with um, a vacuum sealed baggie so um, no water can damage or get in there so I'm happy about that okay and, um, here is our toolkit <laughs> so let's open it up and see what we got may or may not know Manette with the custom diamond paintings you get like a more premium toolkit I have two boats here it's your normal little standard boat um, a few baggies for spare drawers um, <laughs> a nice slim line um, washi tape I do apologize um, please do not look at my nails I had to cut them um, my Yorkies and I were playing and your my finger got there in the way so i do apologize about that but look at this um roll of washi that is a lot i love that because sometimes you just get a little bit this is a lot and it's a little fishies that's cool and then i do love my purple tweezers look at that look at the pretty pretty purple love that and it's very pokey <laughs> So just putting the cap over it and then this is so cute, listen. <laughs> so um, I love these pens of um, Manette's. It is a twisty twirly pen and inside are little crystals which makes a sound. So these ones is only with a single tip. I like that um, the tip is covered with this pin sort of a cap and then you have your single placer normal bra single placer look there you can see like the little crystals <laughs> that's so cute and it's a pink one. Oh, oh I love that sound I love that sound this is so cute look at that that's so pretty sorry <laughs> so that is our toolkit we have our drawers <laughs> it is squares and it is resin look at those colors okay i know there's special drawers in here we're gonna take a look at that but first let me zoom you out and show you the full glory of this custom diamond painting are you ready let's go okay and this is it <laughs> so we are going to take a closer look but i just wanted to show you the big picture first I had to, uh, my tripod is on its fullest length because this is a big canvas. If you can see there at the bottom, 95 by 95 centimeters. Oh my goodness, she is gorgeous. And here is the tube. It is big, it is big. Nice and sturdy packaging, I love that. So, are you ready that we go closer? Let's do it. Let me do a pan over this. 
So we have our thumbnail there at the top. We have our color list. There's 59 colors. And if you look closely, there's one, two, three, four, five, six colors that starts with a Z. So that is Fairy Dust Drills. So I am looking forward to that. And then let's just do a pan over for the canvas. There on the top it has the coat of this canvas and it's 95 by 95 centimeters. There is another thumbnail and another legend, the same as on the left side. And as you can see, it has the amount, the numbers. So I work with the symbol and I work with the color. The color is the DMC coat, the universal coat. So let's take a look at the symbols. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. A, got the play button to the E, F, uh, reverse G, H, J, K, L, M, N, P, R, and then I asked the U, V, X, Y, Z. The symbols does not look weird. Hmm. They are quite um, clear symbols, I like that. So let's take a look. Oh, these colors. Paste area. There's the code again, 95 by 95 centimeters. Okay. And there is the details, MTT diamond paintings. I will put this um, and all of the details, everything you see in this video and any references I make um, in the description of this video. So just a note, um, I paid for this with my own money. Uh, this is not sponsored. And I'm not affiliated. So this is a um, velvet backed canvas and it is perforated. It has the scalloped edges to avoid fraying. If you look closely on the other side, it's super soft. Oh, if you see little, I have Yorkies. <laughs> Um, so there might be hair everywhere. Look at that. It is such a soft canvas. Oh, it's nice. Um, it is not one of those thin, easy to tear films. I like that. And it's not too thick as well. So it's nice to work with. Let's do the sticky test. Okay. <laughs> That's very sticky. <laughs> this is port glue. And our drills are resin. Oh, the symbol clarity is good. It's as expected from Annette. Thank you so much. So, um, I love that the dark fields have light symbols and the light fields have dark symbols. And look at the rendering of the faces. I think it's just incredible. You can see its faces. And the hair. Look at the girl's face. Oh, it's beautiful. You can even see her nails. Like, seriously, can you see that? You can see the back of her long nails. That is amazing. Um, we're going to take a look at the colors now. So, first off, I want to say that this is... A very special canvas a very special image it was created by a dear friend of mine um, and i wanted to do a big shout out to her so i will link her contact details in this description below please feel free to um, message her on facebook and ask her if you would like a commission so she can do commission artwork and you can take that high resolution image from her that you buy and then um, you can take it to any diamond painting company that you like to do a custom of it. So I got the high resolution image from her and I gave it to Minette and this is what I got. And I am mind blown because it is beautiful. So my friend Jean Wellman. Thank you so, so much for this. So Jean um, created this image and um, yeah, 
it is just so special she knows exactly what i like and um, this just spoke to me this is amazing you can also find some of jeans artwork on ntd diamonds um and some other diamond painting companies um that she has already uh, licensed out her artwork to them but if you want her to do anything for you like create an image create you can give her um, ideas and tell her what you would love and she can create it for you so i must just disclose this is ai um but you have to make up your own mind about ai art um this was created by jean this is not a fast simple process she um did quite a few images um of this sort of image and then um i chose the one that i liked the most um but she is amazingly talented because i cannot imagine this and create this <laughs> with software um, i'm sorry but i can't do that so that is a topic for another time um if you like what you think about ai or whatever it's up to you it is just beautiful um so you are welcome to contact jean and tell her listen i love this and this and this or i like this and this and she can create something for you but um jean has been in my diamond painting um, world for quite a long time she knows what i like <laughs> i love that i don't even have to describe what i like um, she uh, listens carefully she's a good listener a good observer and she created something for me that she knows um, that means that is meaningful and that is that that speaks to my heart so if you've been with me for as of for a while as well you would know that um I love this type of thing. I love dog art, beautiful dog art, as I always say. Um, because I have long blonde hair, um, um, this feels very personal. Um, I have been haunted by post traumatic experiences, felt captured inside that bubble. And this is just so gorgeous. Like this is perfect this speaks to me this speaks to my heart and jean i want to say thank you so 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 much thank you for being my friend um you are so appreciated i love you lots and this just means the world to me so um this is super special this i knew immediately i wanted to make as a diamond painting and wow okay so this is a 95 by 95 centimeters i asked manette um <laughs> i wanted no ab's um i please wanted fairy dust trolls so um she surprised me with six of them <laughs> that is amazing so we need to take a look at how they look and where they will be going so we already take, have taken a look at the clarity i love it there's nothing i see that doesn't look clear enough that i don't even have to use a light pad but i like using a light pad because most of my paintings are on the darker side um so in the evenings of the work that's usually when i sit and diamond paint and then you know especially these dark parts um i see there's some force in between the stars and there's some arrows so you know that might be a bit dark um in the evening to sit with without a light pad but I think like as I sit here, it's very easy to um, to differentiate between them. So it's not like something close enough to a star that, oh goodness. I've um, seen uh, another video of an unboxing where it was like an O and a D, for instance, capital letters. That was very confusing. That looked like you could make a mistake, but you won't be making mistakes here. Um, Manette also has... Um, high involvement in the rendering of an image so she she gives her input so um you would have seen that the colors are 59 so it's not extreme it's not like a computer generated heavy thing i asked her for fairy dust rolls she put it in there so she has a lot of involvement in looking at this she sent me pictures um a few sizes of images to choose from i love her so much the details are amazing 
I think it would just look amazing. Look at her leg shining through that translucent dress. Oh, and then it's starting to get to autumn here in South Africa because it's been feeling like summer even if autumn officially started. It's still super warm, but I love the leaves at the bottom here and the trees without leaves here that it fell off. And it just has such autumn colors. And I love this gold parts to a dress. That is so beautiful. Guys, I love this. But like to see, to actually see her fingernails, like look at that ghost behind her. Like you can see the hair and everything. That is amazing. Oh, I can't wait to do this. Okay, so um, you would see there's some wrinkles, but it's only on the film. This um, beauty has been rolled up in the tube. It was safe. So this is just on top the film. Once you're done and you've pulled it off, when you've worked on a section, it's gone. The canvas is flat at the bottom, as you can see. So there's nothing to worry about. These things are just on top, on the surface. So that's what I like about board glue as well. Okay. Are we ready to take a look at the inventory sheet and our drawers? I think so. Okay, this is our inventory sheet. So there is our details again. This is just a piece of paper. Um, so it tells you information. So there you have your amount. It says 59. Um, there's your symbols, there's your DMC code, your color, the original quantity, the actual quantity. So remember, you always get a bit more um, so that you, there might be, if there's a, a draw issue or something, you know, a bit of trash or something, um, then there's more to work with. So you can see there's a lot more given. So I like that. Um, the weight of the drills and then the amount of bags in each of these colors so like there would be three bags of 310 wow you would think that there would be more bags but they're probably big bags <laughs> let's take a look so that's 12,404 so we're getting 13,200 okay there's a lot more 939 so that's your midnight blue i really like that um so it looks like the black 310 is the second most um drills and then the most is the 939 that's gorgeous so that's the shaving so there is the thumbnail or the the, the the stock image in all her glory look at that is that not so beautiful Look at look at that, the nails, the smokiness, there's a face. And she's strapped like on the inside this glass. And then she's like wanted. Oh, that's so beautiful. That is so beautiful. And there it says again, square resin. Okay. And in total there's two, 72 bags. Okay, let's take a look just at the sticker sheet. This whole page, A4 size, is a sticker sheet. Look at that. So it is, it says NTT Diamonds, start date, end date. I like that because I like to keep track of when I start and finish. Diamond shape, it's squares and it's resin drills, 95 by 95 centimeters. And there's the code of this painting. Um, and then these are pre-cut stickers, which is awesome. So it's already been cut for you. You can just peel it off, put it on your containers or put it on the zip baggies, whichever you work out of. And then, yeah, let us take a look. Sorry for the noise, guys. Did you see how I coordinated with the gold? Yes, you know I'm a gold girl. <laughs> okay. So let's take a look. Um, ah, baggy number one. So this is pre-bagged like that. 
Um, I know that some people just like work out of containers, but I've started because I have so many whips. <laughs> a whip is a work in progress, so it started with the diamond painting. And um, I saw diamond paintings, um, and then I have so many of them, so I started working out of the Ziploc baggies because who has like a million storage um, containers? So, not me. Um, but look at that, look at the quality of the drills. No dimples, which is an indicator of acrylic. Look at that sparkle. Look at that sparkle. Oh my goodness, this is gorgeous. It's one of my favorite colors. It's a burgundy color. Oh, it's beautiful. I don't see any obvious trash or knobs or anything sticking out anything they look all same size to me just looking quickly at them um that looks good so this is baggie number one so then we take a look at our reference sheet and number one is symbol number one and it is dmc code 154 okay so if we look at the inventory sheet maybe that's better there's one bag that okay cool um, I don't think I want to take out all of them. Um, let's just take a look at the colors and I'm going to take out the special ones. So we have some light winter white colors, light blue. What's this? This is a... Oh, oh my goodness. This is fairy dust. Oh. Look at that sparkle. It's, it's like um, a powder glitter inside um, the, the drawers. And it is just beautiful. 57. That is our 3799. Wow. Oh, two bags of them. I'm dying. I'm dying inside. Oh, this is beautiful. It's like a gunmetal charcoal color. So let's take our fairy dust rolls out and put it on side oh it's beautiful okay um we have some dark blues no oh my gosh oh my gosh that is another fairy dust oh guys Manette, your fairy dust rolls are amazing wow that is gorgeous. Oh, that's gonna be a beautiful sparkle. Tell me, what do you guys like more? Babies, fairy dust, jellies. There's so many enhancement rolls now, but I'm in a fairy dust mode. I am currently in that phase. So, let's just take a look. This is 58. Yes, that's also a fairy dust. Um, so you see the lighter colors, it's a bit more subtle, but still more sparkle than a non fairy dust draw. That's beautiful. That is 59. That is 3865. That's the winter white. I call it winter white. This is also a fairy dust. You can see it in, in the light. You can see it has that extra fiery sparkle, but it's more subtle, the lighter colors. So then we have 55, that's another one. This is like a beigey dark green one. Look at that. Oh, also fairy dust, gorgeous. And then, what's this? 54. Yes, that's also very dust. Okay, there's a bit of trash. But it's not part of them, so that's fine. Okay, so this is definitely a more subtle, subtle look. But you can see a bit of shimmer. Okay, so let's just take a look. One, two three four five six that's our six fairy dust rolls 
let's just take a look at the other draw colors quickly so this is like a creamy color there's like a dark nude some brown colors peachy there is some teals some more neutrals grayish neutrals very light peach gray Maybe this is a mint minty light minty color um it goes a bit darker and there's another one light blue um we're going to our blues there's a dark brown light green there's like a brownish color brownish this must be 34 this looks like yeah 939 so this is the one you have most of it says seven bags okay so that's your midnight blue your navy blue it's gorgeous the darker colors give so much sparkle i love that so there's one two three four five six seven that's right there's seven of them then we have some browns There we have like a dark army green, some blues, different shades, some greens. There's like also like a dark red. There's uh, brown, that's a warm brown. It's like a dark nudish color. Ooh, ooh, they wanted to escape. Uh, there's like a brown, there's also like a creamy color, a brown. Okay, here I see some some stragglers. It's like a white, the brown, but in this blue. But otherwise, like it's not it's stragglers, but I don't see any trash or anything wrong with the drills themselves. They are so faceted, oh, super sparkly. And browns. It's like a what is this color? Seventeen. Six two. Um, then we have a light brown. There's a beautiful light green. There's a light grayish green. Oh, this is pretty. Um, some greens, dark green, some more light. Oh, that's a dusty pink. Uh, like a mauvey, mauvey color, dusty blue. Um, and then we have some grays some different shades of gray and then number four these are three ten there's three bags of them so they are packed ooh 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 you want to escape you want to escape no no go back okay so there is one two three so they said there would be three and there's three look at that There's a straggler as well. And they <laughs> these bags are packed, packed to the rim. Okay. So <laughs> I tried really hard to keep them um, so that I can roll them up um nicely again my favorites of these fairy dust is definitely the darker ones um yeah so let's take a look where they go um let's take a look so we have 56 and 57 mm, it's the arrow left arrow and it's like this antenna thing okay let's take a look so i think the left arrow this one the, the dark blue it's going to be scattered all through the canvas because we saw them all through the 
black um, the 939 with the stars and the 4 is the 310 is the black so there's there's a lot of the all of these um, arrows is going to be this beautiful fairy dust oh it is like everywhere in the dark oh it's give, gonna give that an amazing amazing shimmer look at that everywhere and then there's that other one you see that it looks like an antenna it's also there so it is everywhere in the outlines um, there's some more of them oh in the faces my goodness there's another face let's take a look there's a lot of them do you see it's that arrow thingy and then that blue arrow and then that gray antenna so they are in the faces there's a lot of arrows and our main goal yep do you see all those antennas there all the antennas in between our hair strands there are no eyes oh that's beautiful oh there in the neck oh it's just scattered everywhere guys the darkness is going to be full of these shimmering look at that the antennas and the arrows they're just everywhere in the eyes of the ghosts there. it's everywhere it's going to be just scattered everywhere okay that is our two dark fairy dusts then we have let's start with 54 55 so it is our light gray and um, that is the five symbol 55 it is that little Y. So by mm, the inner dress, do you see those little Y's with two um, lines or stripes in between them? Okay. And the by, there's, there's some. So with fairy dust, they, they, and just like ABs, they are scattered usually. It's very little that you get like a batch of them. There's a lot in a dress, the by the Y's with the stripes. So it looks like it's it's on the dress. Because there's not too many of them. And then 58 and 59. So let's take a look. Um I see a lot of the by symbols and stuff here still oh yeah yes all of these like that z that's sigma whatever sign big symbol it's a lot it's in the dress um and then the other one is the square with a circle Hmm. Yeah, in a dress. There's some. Um, do you see? There's a lot of the fairy dust in here. Her face has. Oh, do you see her cheeks? Hmm. Sure, there's going to be a lot. Oh, it's the top of her head. Oh, okay, there is in her hair. So obviously the light shining from that side. And then here also as well, the glass case. Look at that. It's all going to be fairy dust, you see. Okay, so there's some patches, which is cool.
All right. I am super super excited to start this beauty. It looks like the the background color is going to be some color blocking, which means a lot of the same symbol and color you can multiply um, if you are comfortable with that in these patches. But then in the details, there's going to be um, a lot of confetti. So I think it looks more confetti than color blocking, um, but it's good. Um, it's not too much of one. I think um, confetti gives a lot of shading and a lot of detail. So, guys, what do you think? I love this. This canvas is so soft. It is so soft. Oh, it's gonna work like a dream. I can't wait to start this and to see how it looks. And I love that there's no area really that's boring that doesn't have something in it that you can watch popping out look at that face like there it's so clear like from the image as well that we got like there do you see that is amazing it's gorgeous i love this so guys i think the, this rendering looks amazing um and well done Monette. Um, I can encourage anybody to take a look and buy from Monette, do customs from her because um, this is my second custom from her. I am just in love. I just think this looks so amazing and I would encourage anybody to go take a look at Monette's website. Go and check out the description of this video for all the details and I'm also going to put in um, jeans contact details so please reach out to Jean I think she is so talented um, I've been following a few AI artists but I must say not just because Jean is one of my friends um, I won't be paying a lot of money for a diamond painting if I didn't love the image and thought that this looks amazing like she ca has her proportions right um everything looks nice and perfect um so i just i really love her artwork and there's actually so many that i still want to get from her but um yeah i just really encourage you guys um go take a look ask her maybe um give her a description of what you like and um maybe she has already done an image and she can show you and then you can um, always purchase the high resolution image because I do um, encourage you that don't take a, a smaller resolution um, for a diamond painting. You need the high res spec and that you buy from the artist. And remember, we support our artists, so it is also living for them. So um, again, I purchased this with my own money. Um, I all my opinions and thoughts are that of my own. Um, I do really um, find this very special because she made it um, for me when I was in, in a very dark place and I needed this. So um, I thank you, Jean, that uh, you are that type of friend that <laughs> I don't even have to say something to you, you know. And um, you just present it so well and perfectly in a piece of art. And I just think that is amazing. So thank you so much. Um, guys, so yes, I am really, really happy with the quality that I'm seeing. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this. If you have any questions um, for me, please let me know in the comments. I would really appreciate if you would give this video a like before you leave so that I know that you enjoy this. This has really exceeded my expectations. And... Yeah, the image as well as the rendering um, this is amazing so yeah Jean's work is definitely very um, compatible to um, make as diamond paintings and um, yeah if you like this sort of thing go check it out remember even though I love my dog art um, she also does any sort of other art so it's not the, just dog or horror so don't worry about that um, you can literally tell her anything that you like and she can create something she's just so creative and talented and um, i'm definitely going to make some more diamond paintings from her artwork i think it's gonna look amazing 
I am just so blown away by this. So thank you so much. Um, guys, I'm going to love and leave you. Uh, I hope that you enjoyed this. And before you leave, also, if you haven't already subscribed, please consider subscribing. And go and check out the description in um, this video so that you can find the link to my Facebook group. If you want to become part of um, the Facebook group in there, Otherwise, you are welcome to leave comments on this video. If there's any questions you have or comments, let me know what you think. Um, yeah, guys, thank you so much. And until next time, love you lots. Bye. Mwah.